Hey guys, Gary Dean, DetailJuice.com. Got my infinite use detail juice here. I've got my eco rinse machine here. Uh, I've got three gallons of water in this bucket behind me. I'm going to demonstrate for you today how you can run the infinite use detail juice through the eco rinse machine to pre soak for the Gary Dean wash method, or you can use it for a waterless wash. So, first thing I'm going to do is this is the three gallon mark right here. Now you're gonna, the newest formula of the Infinite Use Detail Juice is the only product that's gonna be uh, able to be used in the Eco Rinse Machine without damaging anything, without gumming up the pump, for sure. Uh, now we know this because we've been testing it uh, and we had to tweak the formula a little bit to make it work, but it's awesome, won't gum up the pump, find a flow through you're going to use it at one ounce per gallon of water in uh whatever tank you're using for the eco rinse machine now i've got about well it's three ounces of water in or i'm sorry three ounces of the infinite use detail juice right here you're gonna watch me add it to this carboy with three gallons of water in it And that's that. Set that out of the way. Put the lid on. Okay. Then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to shake it up, mix it in there. All mixed up, good to go. Now, can't quite see it. I'll turn you so you can see it. I'm gonna use, gonna hook up the eco rinse machine to the deal. I'm gonna use my trash can. Right here, get you going here. A little bit of difficulty keeping the uh, camera on the tripod, but here we go. Good to go here. Got the uh, tank vented. So got three gallons of infinite use detail juice. Gonna be running it through the eco rinse machine, which is plugged in. You want to prime everything. So you want to squeeze the trigger until something comes out of it prior to turning on the unit. Now, actually, there we go. <laughs> Had my ball valve shut. So anyway, prime the unit until liquid comes out, which it's coming out now. Now we can turn the unit on. There it comes. All right. So, we've got to adjust the unit to how we want the spray to be. All the way loose will give you just a short spray and barely any pressure. We want pressure. That's the benefit to this thing. Find what works for you and roll with that. So now you see everything is hooked up right here. Now I'm going to take you over to the vehicle, show you how to execute the Gary Dean wash method. There we go. We'll let that run for a second. Now we're going to use the infinite use detail juice at a quarter of an ounce per gallon of water. I've got a gallon of water in that bucket. The cap is a quarter of an ounce. Nothing has changed with the infinite use detail juice other than we have modified it to work properly in the eco rinse machine and not to gum up the pump. That is all that's changed. So, to 
that to the side. I'm just gonna do one towel demo for, for this situation. But like I mentioned in the uh, last video, the wand will be 12 inches, so it will stop here and this is where the nozzle will be and the nozzle will have a cover on it. Uh, so, here we go. You can either use it like this to pre-soak the panel and break down any dirt that's on it. Or you can crank up the pressure and really get some juice out of it. Got a little air in the line. So we're spraying infinite use detail juice right there. And there you go. There you have it, right there. Nothing to it. You can vary your pressure from very low stream of pressure to a uh, 1100 PSI dirt killing pressure. And so that's that. I'm gonna lighten up the pressure a bit now. Basically just uh, loosening up the pressure regulator. Almost all the way out so that you can see you get nothing when you do it too much. There we go. There we go. Now you can do just a light mist if you want over the whole surface but you're still getting about 300 PSI out of this thing. I mean, it doesn't get any better than this, guys. You can spray the juice, or you can do a traditional wash with it. However you do it, you can either use a lot of pressure up to 1100 PSI or very little pressure. And so that's the key here. If you just want to use the machine to spray, you can do that. If you want to use the pressure that's available to you to unbond the contaminants from their spot prior to washing, you can do that too. So using the infinite use detail juice at one ounce per gallon, the newest formula which will launch March 1st, you will not have a problem using this Eco Rinse machine to spray on your infinite use detail juice in any fashion that you want. Um, the coolest part, if you turn the pressure way down, you got still more pressure than you would have from a pump sprayer or from a low pressure system and you're unbonding contaminants so that when you wipe them off, you're not having to unbond them in your wiping motion, which is saving the paint from potential swirl marks or rubbing in grit to the paint. Now again, waterless washing is not a perfect system. I don't recommend it, I don't like it, but this Eco Rinse Machine is for you. If you're in a water restricted environment or situation, or you just want to carry less water, it's perfect. A half of a gallon per minute flow, 1100 PSI, and 6.3 amp draw. It doesn't get any better than that. So anyway, that is how I run the Infinite Use Detail Juice out of the Eco Rinse Machine. So if you guys got questions, 813-846-4406. Um, you can text me, message me, leave me a voicemail, whatever. You want to do to get a hold of me i will answer your questions this thing will be 
around the $750 mark. I just added some accessories if you saw the last video. Uh, originally, I had a price in mind and I added some stuff to it. Uh, it's going to come with uh, the unit itself mounted to a plate with rubber feet. It'll have uh, quick disconnects on both sides of the hose. It'll have a 50 foot hose, 5 16ths inner diameter, so it's less cumbersome and easier to manipulate and move around than the 3 8 inch hose. Uh, but it will also have a 12 inch wand with a plastic. Uh, nozzle cover on it so that there's no potential to scrape the paint with uh, the the metal nozzle that's on there so again thanks for watching I really appreciate you guys for watching these videos I know I babble a lot but uh, again I just let this pump run the whole time I was talking so um, just because it works fine so anyway thanks again guys have a wonderful day